have breaking news that a man is standing aside Damari Thomas. His house has just fallen, came down on his wife. Over to you, Damari. Boom. Thanks, Jason. My name is Damari Thomas, and I'm here with the man that survived the earthquake. His house just came down on his wife. What were you doing before the earthquake hit? I was sitting on the couch with my wife, watching a movie, right? And all of a sudden, the ground started rumbling. We didn't, know what, we didn't know what to do. We were trying to get out of the house and her leg got caught under the couch. She told me to leave and save myself, but I was like, no, I, I can't leave you here. It was too late. I just managed, I just managed. I tried to save her, but I just, it was too late. I tried, I, I just managed to get out, get out of time. I lost all my goats. Just, it was just a tragic day. Well, there you go. Back over to you, Jason. Thanks, Damari. Well, we are sorry for your loss. Well, here are some pictures after the earthquake hit. Channel 13 News. Three until the 2010 earthquake. There were a lot of people who came to help Haiti after the 2010 earthquake. Even though Haiti was destroyed, they're still fighting back for who they used to be. This is a picture of the Port-au-Prince Capitol building before and after the 2010 earthquake. Even after six years, Haiti is still not fully rebuilt.